Well, hello everyone. Here is here right here of talking about for A plus right here and uh, talk about your know, students though. And uh, a lot of times it sure seems that way that uh, you know I have a uh, you know we all been in that situation to where that whenever you work real hard on something, and a lot of times that that the first thing that's really going to come to your mind is to where that to what all have you really missed? And if there's anything that you could that you know that you could have done better on, and uh, you know something such as is to where whenever you work real hard. And find out that, that you know for a lot of things they're supposed to meet the requirements right and a lot of times that the first thing that really comes to your mind is toward it uh, knowing about how much hard work and uh, so let's just say that, that for the most part that if most of your hard work that had to be you know recorded and let's just say that uh, that I can maybe also uh, use it uh, like a, a PowerPoint file or an Excel file or some some um, program like that just to be able to show some more examples here, but really that, uh, that uh, you know, I guess the main objective would mainly be a buzz is toward it trying to uh, tell, uh, you know, others uh, just to try and get them to understand just a little bit more about uh, what is it that they're looking at. And a lot of times that that's usually the case is toward it, yeah, what, you know, show what, what all that you put together and what all that you were able to accomplish and all that. So let's just say that, uh, that uh, if you were to be, uh, you know, yeah, if you were to be uh, telling somebody about the, the top objectives uh, that, uh, that had to be you know, in place, and let's just say, you know, if one of those is maybe going to be a bias as to where, yeah, you know, to, uh, to go ahead and read off, uh, uh, you know, the first uh, you know, four paragraphs uh, to your guest. And so let's just say that if you're going to be having a meeting with somebody about something that you're going to be working on or anything that you're trying to put together, trying to piece together and trying to approve or something like that, and uh, let's just say that yeah, if it's uh, if it's anything that's uh, you know about you know you know maybe the questionnaires or maybe English skills or something like that, or maybe just to getting to know the group a little bit more or something like that. So it sure seems that way that um, that you go ahead and say a few uh, words, and let's just say that you know, yeah, since I was young, uh, you know, I want to go into you know the best scores, and when I uh, you know wanted to be a like all the other kids, and like, you know, my son, so yeah, this right here is actually talks about, is to where getting to know the other kids, and want to know what is it that they're thinking about, and, you know, for what that, you know, for like, yeah, when somebody, uh, trying to make somebody else, uh, you know, feel, in, like, yeah, you know, for what makes you feel important, you know, like, for other, what other, you know, classmates think about what you were, what you were working on, of. but, but on your hand, that, that, um, it sure seems that way that uh, for the most part that um, that how often do we go really think about is to where that a lot of your hard work though what do we mean by hard work I'm talking about is to where that whenever somebody else realizes as and and that, that person that that reader can see about how much hard work that you put into something and let's just say that uh, if it's not going to be anything like a document so far as, uh, you know, yeah, I get to know the class or anything like that. But let's just say if it's maybe a few math problems or it could be a letter just to explain about, uh, you know, yeah, fixing, you know, any source of equipment that's related to maybe a job performance or maybe uh, anything about what you call diagnostics, uh, you know, any source of, uh, of data, you know, response or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. so let's just say if you're trying to test the equipment or trying to read back at the analysis uh, report about something in there so it's like whenever you first start working a job though that um that uh, you're able to uh, retrieve data right and so a lot of times it's like uh, that uh, whenever you're going to be working a lot of times that uh, do really uh, do other students really see uh, what is it that you're working on and in the first part you know, like uh we can probably say too that uh that you know most of the time you no know, uh, that uh, you know does um, a uh, lot um, of your hard work. So when we say that, when we say hard work, a lot of times, do we necessarily uh, think about you know too much about the fact about you know yeah hard work is hard work right? You know that's just uh, another that's just a word a phrase and like another word a phrase but. But let's just say, though, that uh, on average, though, if we can use hard work right there, just because of the fact that um, when we say hard work, you know, are we necessarily stating toward it uh, 
that whenever you put, uh, you know, you've been working maybe five days straight on this job. And uh, let, so let's just say that, yeah, five days straight. So what does that usually mean whenever somebody says something like that? I'm like, uh, yeah, you five, five days, if you know, say five days straight right here. So let's just say that um, does um, a lot of the hard work, you know, five days straight, you'll know, count count and you know if it does that uh, you know yeah does it really pay off i'm like a, you know the, the word that i actually would like to use is talking about for the can you know does that allow those other objectives to be canceled out so it's like if we were to go so by say is to where the yeah cancel yeah for canceled out right there so let's just say that uh, on average though that if you were to have to start working on something and let's just say that, that the first thing that you see uh, whenever you come up to an objective is maybe going to be 10 things that you really have to, like, yeah, 10 things maybe within 30 days that you have to do. And uh, a lot of us would say, too, that that seems like a lot of pressure. I'm like, uh, yeah, a lot of stuff that that uh, you'll just be able to, to accomplish an assignment and just to be able to uh, do a job. And let's just say that if you're hired to do any sort of job, working with any clients or colleagues or anybody and that uh, you want to know too uh, is that uh, you know yeah that um that you know if there was an objective maybe let's just say that there was maybe 10 things on that that, that objective that uh, that had to be completed uh, in order to be able to consider the job done and uh, so let's just say on average though that um that maybe the only time that maybe an objective would be canceled out. Maybe is the fact about if somebody decides that they're going to go and change your mind and say that you don't have to worry about that or it's it's already taken care of. So, a lot of times it sure seems that way that the, most of us would say too that um, that the, the first thing is first though is that uh, number one if you're going to see a list of uh, these different priorities and different objectives, right? You know, think of uh, you know, yeah you know, try to highlight. The most important part of the task, and let's just say that uh, something that you're familiar with. And uh, so let's just say that on average, though, that uh, if you were to write a list of the different objectives that had to be taken care of, and let's just say that um, if uh, one of them uh, would be maybe deliveries or something like that, I can go ahead and, like right down here, I can go ahead and maybe just add like a little uh, you know, list right here about, you know, yeah... <laughs> You know, you go ahead and say on here, I'll go and just write right here, actually. Um, put right there, yeah, yeah, go and say deliveries. So let's just say that, you know, yeah, deliveries. And then um, I can go and put like a, a, a bolt right there. But let's just say that these were the objectives right here, the deliveries. And then also... Uh, if it's going to be, you know, uh, you know, yeah, packaging or something like that. Packaging plus labels. So if you were to come up with a, with a list of different things right here, and then also you answering calls, answering messages, answer messages and calls. So let's just say that uh, if somebody were to, you know, I'm like, yeah, and calls, I can... I can maybe put on here, yeah, ticket orders. So let's just say on average, though, that um, that tickets, though, that if somebody were to say, is to if you're hired for a job, and let's just say that uh, if somebody were to ask you, is to word it, you know, you'll be in charge of, uh, you know, of, yeah, come, you know, like, yeah, verifying the tickets. So, so, so it's like, yeah, if you were at the ticket stand, and let's just say that, uh, that the first thing is first, is that whenever you do a, uh, wind up getting hired for a, for a job, right? And let's just say that if somebody were to say that you'll be responsible for all these tasks right here for the packaging and labels. And let's just say if it's on a job description, especially. If it's on a job description. So a lot of times, we probably say too that, you know, you're not looking forward to doing all that stuff. But let's just say on average, though, that with most job descriptions, though, that, uh, yeah, that, you know, first... Uh, for the most part, that, you know, try to be familiar with a lot of the stuff that it, that's explained on those job descriptions. So, like anybody says to where if you're trying to be familiarized, if you were to try to familiarize yourself with uh, a lot of the things that are in detail on uh, the, 
the job descriptions and for the most part that um, you want to know too that, that the reason why you didn't go any further with that application was just because of the fact that all the, the tasks and responsibilities they were on there but let's just say if you were working hard on something and let's just say if you were working five days straight on something and that you could that also allow as to where that those other tasks would be canceled out to where that yeah somebody else took care of it for you where it's all if it's recognized then that those tasks would not have to be completed and so like let's just say that uh you know uh, you know how many of us who want to know too that um that uh, you know yeah does our hard work really pay off at some point and if we're talking about that um that that uh, you know if you were to be working hard on something for maybe for four weeks straight and uh, you want to know too hey you know if you were to be working hard on something and somebody actually sees that you're working hard on something then maybe that uh, you know yeah you know those other tasks and other you know yeah those other tasks and other objectives that uh, that you were supposed to take care of from earlier you may not even have to worry about those other ones now and you know just because of the fact that uh, you know that uh, that you know, you would only really and I know a lot of job descriptions would also say too that uh, you know you would actually put those details on a job description mainly because of the fact that um, just so that way that uh, you know yeah well whenever you actually go to that location and whenever you actually talk to uh, that the, the manager there at uh, at that place so Michael let's just say if it's at a factory or maybe at an office then then uh, you know yeah you would uh, you may not even be in charge of doing all that you know if anything that uh, you know they'll probably ask you to uh, that you'll be at the ticket stand or you would actually be in charge of uh, the label so it's like uh, so whenever you do put in an application for a job a lot of times which I see that a lot of times but still that um, that for the most part that um, that you actually the first thing that you say is to where that you're actually are seeking for part-time employment and uh, so let's just say that uh, on average though that uh, yeah you know for the most part that, that you actually uh, whenever you first start applying for the job that you were actually seeking for part-time employment, but let's just say, on average, that uh, that yeah, well, really, that uh, I think most of the time, like everybody else would say too, uh, is that uh, you know you go ahead and wait until you get feedback from everybody else, maybe a few of the other coworkers, and just to see how well that you're doing, and just know about as to where if you're really hired, you know, for part-time or for full-time work, right? But but you know that's kind of like want to know about my question to where that. Um, that whenever it comes to uh, looking at a lot of the hard work that you've been, and let's just say if a lot of the stuff right here was maybe a few math problems, and let's just say that maybe if I could maybe put in a few math problems here. So let's just say if I were to say something like, you know, yeah, your know, times. So let's just say that, yeah, <laughs> anybody say if you want to go ahead and include uh, maybe a few math problems or anything like that, your know, times times five that uh, you know equals or something like that and uh, so let's just say that if I were to include like a little math equation right there and uh, you want to know too that if you can maybe solve a few math problems right here and want to know too that hey that uh, if people can actually see that you were actually working hard during the process so when they can see that uh, that if you go ahead and and explain in detail about how you were able to come up yeah, yeah, like an equation. How you able to come up with that, with a few of the results and the problem and all that. So it's like, so a lot of times it's like um, that whenever you first start working on something, though, uh, that uh, there's going to be requirements, right? And uh, the first thing that you read is that uh, what is required, that uh, that you, you're you supposed to do this and you're supposed to do that. And, uh, you know, yeah, you know, we give you a, a list of objectives that you got to do. And let's just say if a lot of those objectives is maybe going to include is toward that you know, you go ahead and talk to somebody who has the experience or if anything who's willing to train you on the job. And uh, so it's like um so it's like whenever you first see this list of uh top priority about the uh, you know, yeah. Whenever you read the details right there, and uh, the first thing that's like they say too, that um uh, that you know you try to think about that to where that um that, uh, you know, yeah, that a lot of the hard work that you put into something, and that maybe that um, you might say is to where that, uh, 
you put a lot of hard work into something and you may want to know too that uh well you know and then I, i'm gonna you know i'm gonna need to get ready to take the test and then so so let's just say that on average though if somebody were to tell you that um if you do very well on this uh quiz if you do well on the quiz though then maybe you won't even have to take the test and if you do have to take the test and like everybody else would say too that um if you you know, I'm like yeah you take one exam or if anything you go to that meeting I'm like yeah if you're able to go to that meeting and and people were to ask you to check out check out the work that you do and so a lot of times it sure seems that way that um that the first thing that you think about a lot of times is that uh, yeah a lot of hard work that needs to be recorded right and um so if those clients and if the managers of the team can actually see a lot of your hard work being recorded and uh they say 102 that you know if you've been working hard on something for five days straight you know how often are you really going to see canceled out to where you don't have to worry about that these uh, three remaining objectives here because they're, they're no longer required so a lot of times you want to know too that um you know really that uh you know you get um if you see a list of priorities that have to be made within maybe the first 30 days, I'm like, if you're maybe on job training or something like that, or if you really are trying to work hard on trying to get something taken care of, and that the first thing that, that, that you're going to maybe say is toward, you, know, you look at all those objectives and you want to know too that really, how do you begin, really? But, um, but first of all, it's like, yeah, try to familiarize you know, yourself with uh, a lot of those uh, objectives and, uh, you know, try talking to those who have experience, number one, and two, though, that if you're able to share any documents and share, you know, anything about, you know, share your skills with somebody, uh, somebody else who, who's familiar with that. So it's like, uh, you want to know, too, that uh, whenever it comes to feedback, especially, you know, doing the surveys and feedback, but, but I just really want to talk about right here, talk about for the count you know, for the hard work that you, that's canceled out right here. So let's just say, on average, though, that, um, you know, if you're willing to go to that meeting, and let's just say, I'll go and put it right here, add up on near the top, is to where if you participate, if you participate um, in the meeting, yeah, if you go to that meeting, yep, so if you go to the meeting, and let's just say if somebody were to tell you, uh, if you come to our meeting, then yeah, you know, don't worry about those other objectives there. So let's just say if somebody were to tell you that uh, if you come to this meeting, you know, yeah, yeah, go to the meeting, go to the meeting and answer a few questions. You know, you don't have to worry about that other stuff that, that, that you were told from earlier. And, you know, and if you do, then yeah, you know, try to work that out. But, you know, still, that, uh, so it sure seems that way to try not to get overwhelmed about, you know, the situation whenever it comes to taking care of important tasks. And a lot of everybody else would say, too, that, yeah, well, really, that, uh, you know, does that really, you know, like, yeah, does that really pay off on, on its own whenever it comes to uh, taking care of, uh, you know, some of the important, yeah, yeah, and tasks and responsibilities also. And you want to know, too, that... Um, that, uh, you know, yeah, does your hard work really need to be recognized? But a lot of times, and it sure seems that way, that uh, people might even say that, yeah, well, really, that uh, if you go to the meeting, yeah, go to the meeting. Just mainly focus on, you know, if you were able to go to that meeting, you know, that meeting is going to be about five guests there. You tell them what you do and what you're good at, and then also uh, anything important that you want, that you need to share and talk to them about. And uh, so it's like, you know, you may not be able to get through everything, you know, you may not be able to get to everything, but still, that, uh, but it sure seems that way that, um, that, you know, uh, what's the best way of how to explain it to where if you're not able to talk about everything that, uh, you know, really, if, uh, you know, whoever that, uh, that still needs to know that information, but at the same time, no, I'm like, yeah, that, uh, I can also talk about like barrel, like, uh, but, uh, you know, you know, barriers and, but, um, Whenever it comes to requirements, though, what's the first thing that comes to your mind whenever it comes to requirements? It's another way of how you want to call it a rule, right? It's a basic rule. But a lot of times it sure seems that way that, uh, that you, know, you know, does that really take a lot of your time 
away from maybe a few things that you would suggest also. You know, any suggestions that you would have to give to anybody, and people might even say that, uh, well, really, that uh, you go to that meeting, and if you were to make a suggestion, right? And uh, so it's like, yeah, you know, I suggest, uh, you know, yeah, a few suggestions. So you want to take a, a few moments to give that opportunity to where you want to make a few suggestions, right? So it's like, yeah, you know, uh, you go to that meeting, and it's possible that, uh, yeah, you know, the first, if you received an email and it, it, tell, it told you about the things that you had to follow up with and the things that you had to do, but let's just say, though, that, uh, that you know, after you go to that meeting, then, then they might tell you that you, you can go and disregard those directions there because you don't have to do that. You don't have to, no, you don't have to do those, you know, you don't have to complete those, you don't have to do those those tasks, or those those courses or, or the training. And uh, so a lot of times it's like, yeah, you know, really, that, uh, you know, does that really, I'm like, does the hard work really pay off? And uh, I can go and put that right here too, as to where, you know, paying, uh, pay off and, um, does the hard work really pay off whenever you work real hard at something? And a lot of times, everybody else might even say that, uh, well, really, that, I'm like, that doesn't that really all depend, really? But, you know, on your hand, that, um, but really, though, that uh, if we were to be um, thinking about that, to where that, um, that, you know, if you're quite, you know, like, you might even say, if you're quite used to it, to where that, uh, you know, you're just, um, you know, you read according to what you read on that message that you were told there was the packaging and the labels and then the deliveries. So, you know, if you had to go through maybe four days of training on that, and like a, a lot of times people may want to know too, if you want to go ahead and include on the bottom right here, just just get it over with. And uh, But still, you know, get that, get that over with. <laughs> So if you were to say something like that, and you want to know too, get that over with, and but you know still that, uh, so it sure it sure seems that way that toward that um, that you know there there's going to be some things about the training and maybe some things about the, the hard work that you do that you may not look forward to everything about it, but let's just say though that uh, if you're willing to uh, you know if you're willing to you know to tackle you know if you're willing to work hard to where that you're able to accomplish at least three tasks, at least one or two of them, you know, out of the three weeks or so that you're working hard on something. And uh, let's just say, though, that on average, if, if they can see that you're really working hard at that, and then they'll say is to where, yeah, don't worry about those two other objectives because they're already taken care of. So it, it sure seems that way to where that, uh, you know, the hard work that counts, right? And, um... So that's why it sure seems that way, that uh, whenever it comes to a career and a job, cannot pay for the skills unless if we continue to work hard. And uh, so, yeah, you know, and I know, like, we all part thinking, too, that, uh, you know, no matter how hard you tried, that seems like that you're getting the same results to where that, you know, yeah, you know, it's either if you were accepted or if you were denied in, on the application, but on your hand, too, though, that, um, that uh, a lot of details about what you do uh, that may not be explained uh, in its entirety on the application. So let's just say though that uh, that you know it's, it seems like that there's maybe going to be always something that's maybe going to be missed. But on your hand, that, that that to think about the things that you were able to accomplish mainly, and uh, so that's why it sure seems that way. That um, whenever it comes to uh, participate in a meeting, especially. And I'll tell everybody here that, uh, you know, I think that's, when, if you have a, a meeting or an appointment, especially, you know, it's important, yeah, I say it's, it's, it's extremely important to, uh, to know that um, if you have a meeting, you know, like, yeah, if there's a meeting that, uh, that you're scheduled to go to, and like everybody else would say too, that uh, with those, those meetings, that, um, if you can at least go to one meeting, you know, from all the, you know, I'm like, yeah. So, they might say that if you go to that one meeting, then you won't even have to worry about that, that one objective that, that, that you were told from earlier. And let's just say if it's maybe the deliveries or maybe if it's going to be something else that you were not really looking forward to. And maybe if one of those is 
maybe gonna be about you know yeah that uh, you maybe getting a copy made of something or something like that or maybe deliveries or a verification or something like that but so it sure seems that way that uh, that yeah if you were to read a job description though and if you were to read the details right here and let's just say that those details are going to talk about is as toward that the things that you will be responsible for and let's just say that uh one of them could have been as toward it yeah well you know you would uh you would be responsible for the labeling and then also answering the messages and uh, maybe uh you know traveling or you know like uh, yeah, it's something something that maybe that you cannot do right away at the moment so let's just say that uh, if you were applying for a job and maybe the one of the reasons why that you didn't go any further with the application was over the fact that because that the, you were not able to arrange make the arrangements right there and right then at the moment and uh so i'm sure a lot of companies will, would understand that but on the other hand too that um that whenever you put in a job application most of the time that the, yeah there's assessments and uh with these assessments that the, they're going to ask you the, those questions and all but but still that to participate in the meeting and uh so that's at least that's something that they'll ask you to do is to were to participate in the meeting and if anything that you know if they can see that uh, all the hard work that you put into something uh, you spend five days straight working on something and like everybody else would say too that uh, you know five days straight and uh, five days straight you know does that really pay off at some point or if anything that, that you know really if it's really about you just you know all about the studying but uh, still but on your hand that uh, knowing about a lot of things that you were able to accomplish from earlier though that it sure seems that way that uh, the way we think about that though that um, that when we think about that you know a lot of our hard work and when we say hard work that means is toward it uh, that uh, yeah that that also includes that that a lot of uh, other tasks and a lot of the work that you were doing from before and uh, the countless hours, let, let's just say that uh, if you were maybe working overtime on getting something done. So yeah, so so let, let's just say that uh, if we were to do the count right here, and let's just say like everybody else would say too, that you know, I, I'm sure most of us get the idea, really. But let's just say if it's from 8 a.m. to like, yeah, 8 a.m. to like 5 p.m. From 8, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and it's still not done. Well, what's what's going on? What's the problem? And uh, so, like everybody else would say too, that those time arrangements right there between 8 and 5, right there, that seems like a long. I'm like that seems like a lot of work. And like everybody else would say too, that from 8 to 5. Now, come on, now, you know, I'm, you know, I, I, uh, you know, I can't, you know, do that amount of work within a certain timing. And so, so if we were to actually do the skills, if we would actually do the calculation, though. And let's just say, on average, though, that uh, you know, out of the whole course of the day, though, that maybe if you're only required to, maybe uh, you know, if you're only required to, uh, you know, to provide maybe eight pieces of uh, documents, you know, to about a job that, that that you were asked to do. And let's just say, though, that uh, you know, a lot of the hard work that you know that pays off, and for what we call you know, for don't for, for what's canceled out. And so, like, so it sure seemed like that way to a yeah, you know, what you call that. The great, uh, like, if you if you want to kind of call it to what source of zone or accomplishment that you want to call it, but but on your hand, if we talk about from eight to five p.m. right here, and uh, we probably say too that that you know really, how many of us are really going to look forward to that? If you see that on your schedule, you know from eight to five, that uh, you know yeah, be here and be then, uh, you know, be right there and then you know, so that we can go to the meeting and so that we can get to work and. Uh, yeah, how many of us are going to look forward to that compared to uh, maybe something else that you're going to maybe see up from up here, you know, that you would maybe want to look forward to, uh, you know, some even laugh. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, if you want to, if you would rather participate in the group discussion about, you know, yeah, if, uh, some even laugh. And, um, you know, whenever it comes to, you know, sharing your skills and getting into the groups and, and then also the special gifts and the kindness. And, but on the other hand, that... Um, Whenever we talk about the hard work, though, that if they can see, you know, if that company, somebody can see how much hard work that you put into something, and then if they can see that, and just say, hey, you know, we'll work it out. Don't worry about it. You just come to the meeting. Or, you know, like, yeah. 
But uh, the way I think about it too, though, that um, for good confidence, and like uh, for what makes you a good hard worker, especially, is to where if, if that person can actually see, you know, what is it that you do, and just knowing it, you where that it's recognized. But anyway, thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.